hello my babies welcome back to another video if you're new to this channel welcome today you guys are going to get ready with me to go out <laughs> now if you guys follow me then you know my booty don't go out as much as i used to when i felt like i was younger <laughs> the older i get the more i'm just like let's do netflix and chill um so yeah so you guys are gonna get ready with me and first thing is first i'm gonna go ahead and prime my face with this smashbox primer i love this primer i try not to use it as much because it's so expensive okay and i'm not trying to break a bank for a primer so i kind of use that primer when i'm going out and about okay so to give my face a little bit of um you know, a little bit of hydration. I end up grabbing that for Charlie Rose Mist, and that just helps my skin stay hydrated, and it gives me a little bit of, you know, doing this. So for foundation, I'm grabbing a drugstore foundation. It's been a minute since I rocked a drugstore foundation, so I grabbed this L'Oreal Infallible Foundation in the shade 515. Um, and yeah, this foundation is bomb. I forgot how bomb it is, and you guys are gonna actually get a easy super fresh and easy um valentine's day drugstore valentine's day makeup look this week before friday so look out for that or it might even be on friday one of each okay so for concealer i grabbed this beauty bakery insta bake concealer and you guys know i usually grab another lighter one i just put it in the inner corner just to brighten that area up and i put it on top of um the other parts that i put this concealer now the insta bake uh the shade was a little too like not my type it was not too bright so that's why I had to mix those two together and for that one I grabbed the um, Sista Cosmetics um, it's you concealer Woo, that was a mouthful cuz y'all know I don't have some of these products on me at all I just be looking at this video and you know talking to you guys as I go so I'm just blending that bad boy in oh and also remember everything that I use on my face will be in the description box so make sure you check that out so to contour snatch everything make everything slim okay because we're going out so we got to look bomb that makeup gotta look a one and that's on that okay <laughs> so I grabbed this KKW Beauty um, concealer I am. I was just looking at this concealer, and I'm like, holy mokololi, okay, mokololi. I don't even know what the heck I just said, but I have had this concealer for a minute, and it's been rocking with me for a while. So I'm like, dang, uh, this little tube has really, you know, pulled in. Um, so I'm just blending everything all in like so. Make sure I don't have any harsh lines, and look at that contour, sharp, sharp okay snatched and that's what we're going for so i'm blending everything all in with my beauty blender i didn't use much brushes in this tutorial today because girl a i was getting ready standing up and you guys know i hate doing that um the fact that it was dark and i didn't have any like lighting i just wanted to get ready in the bathroom so i did the standing up makeup i still don't know how people do this because my back was hurting my feet was on fire and i'm just like what is this what is life <laughs> so i'm just gonna end up just blending in my contour my nose contour and look how it just snatched and a one that oh ooh, ooh ah, <laughs> it looks so bomb it looks so good um, so yeah, after blend that all in, I'm gonna grab my Huda Beauty Easy Bake Setting Powder. And y'all thought I was gonna blow in your face. You thought, you thought wrong, okay? So I'm gonna set everywhere all in like so i've been liking the setting powder because look how like it sets in so nice i love this setting powder i don't even remember the last time i've had a crease because that's how good like this setting powder every time i use it it's that bomb and the way i'm actually setting my under eye has been you know made a difference for my whole makeup routine so i'm also going to grab this morphe bronzer and i'm gonna just set where i contoured like so um because it's liquid and you always gotta set your liquids you don't want it to move around you just want to set it i'm not gonna set it with any powder this will act as a powder because i contoured like pretty much around um the outer of my face So for the eyes, I end up grabbing this Beauty of Color eyeshadow palette. Now, I'm not sure if I used this palette on my channel already, but I did use it on my IG um, before once, I think last year, and I decided to grab it today. Y'all see how big the pans are in this palette? It's ridiculous. I am so in love. Now, if you haven't heard of this brand, it's a woman of color owned brand. And you guys know I'm such a sucker of women of color brands. I love supporting them. And, you know, it's, that's just how I do, okay? Um, so I end up rocking those two eyeshadows on my crease as my transition shade. 
And you guys can see how pigmented and vibrant these eyeshadows are. Oh my gosh, I am in love. So now I'm going to grab this Ace Beauty eyeshadow palette and grab that cinnamon eyeshadow. And just work this a little bit lower, but also in that crease. This is just going to darken this look up a little bit more. Um, because I'm also going to smoke out my water lash line. So I wanted everything to just come all together. And with the um, outfit that I was rocking, I figured all of this would just look a lot more prettier. <laughs> so I'm also grabbing that shimmer shade in that uh, beauty of color eyeshadow palette and this is more of like a lighter gold I'm grabbing actually two shimmer shades in this palette you really can't even tell the difference at all when I you know rocked both eyeshadows I was like oh they're kind of similar next to each other um, but in person you can definitely see a difference okay so I'm just working this all over my eyelid with a flat uh, brush from Zova and you guys know it's not me if I'm not snacking or drinking something through a makeup tutorial. <laughs> That's just not me if y'all don't see it. So now I'm going to go back into that Ace Beauty eyeshadow palette and just grab that um, black eyeshadow and just work this in the outer corner of my eye. Um, I will be honest with you guys, I didn't plan this look at all. Just winged it as usual. So I was aiming to match my outfit, obviously. Um, even though I had bangs to cover up my eyes, I wanted my eyes to still pop through the bangs. So I wanted to do a more dramatic look look um so then it doesn't look so plain and yeah because them bangs were really kind of covering my eyes a little bit so i wanted something that's just going to pop and y'all about to see it okay so for eyeliner i'm gonna grab this huda beauty um eyeliner it's actually an eyeliner and a water lash line liner I don't use the eyeliner part because it's not really my 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 forte. I honestly love the Wet n Wild better than this, um, but I'm using the um, uh, the pencil part for my water lash line. And I'm also grabbing that black eyeshadow and that brown eyeshadow and just smoking my water lash line like so. And for blush, I went ahead and grabbed this Laura Mercier blush, and I'm just blushing away like usual. I like this blush because it's subtle and it's just not you know too pigment. You know, it's pigment enough that it looks more natural. So for highlighter, I grabbed this Laura Mercier highlighters. And everything that I tell you guys, shades, all that, will be in the description box. Um, so make sure you check that out. And I'm just highlighting my forehead, even though you're not going to see my forehead with the bangs. Still got to do it, girl. It's just a routine for me. Get that nose, snatch it, give it a little bit of a look. Y'all already know how it is. So for lip liner, I am grabbing this NYX lip pencil. Um, and this is in the shade Brown. And for lipstick, I'm grabbing this Anastasia Matte Lipstick in the shade Nude, you guys. And this completes the whole entire look. And last but not least, I'm going to grab this MAC Lip Gloss. I've been loving this lip gloss. It's it's like gold on your lips. I've been using it as a topper for a lot of my lip gloss um, looks that I've been giving you guys. And y'all have been loving it on Instagram, okay? So definitely try that lip combo out. And to set everything in, I'm going to grab this Fasali Rose Mist. This is just going to bring that hydration back to my skin look dewy and then to matte everything all in and have my makeup last all day i'm grabbing this huda beauty setting spray you guys and that's it for this look like look at you girl you ready to step out okay and that's on period sis is looking fire you guys love bangs on me and i love it too okay but we gonna switch it up y'all know i love switching up my hairstyles or whatever okay so um for outfit you guys i end up grabbing this really bomb af oh bomb bodysuit and pants um from pretty little thing the pants are from pretty little thing and the bodysuit is from fashion nova and this purse is from fashion nova as well like this low-key kind of look like chanel but it's really not <laughs> so for jacket um i grabbed this leather jacket and this is from forever 21 i've had this jacket for like three years now um so this is if completes the look you guys and the hair, I will leave the link to the hair as well, you guys. And y'all know how I do. Okay, this is it. I loved how everything turned out. I'm actually glad I recorded this look for you guys. It was something last minute, so random. But I'm sure you guys still enjoy and love it, you guys. I love y'all so much. Thank you for tuning in. As usual, now up in the sauna. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.